So uh, we will move on to the next problem. Here in this problem also, it's a uh, is asking to compute the centroid of shaded area. So uh, this is also a similar kind of problem what we have discussed in the previous section. So, but with respect to axis, the given axis here, x-axis and y-axis. So uh, now let us be more into the problem. So we know that uh, x bar equals sigma a x by sigma a with respect to y axis y axis and y bar equals sigma a y by sigma a with respect to x axis with respect to x axis so uh, this is what exactly we require to compute x bar as well as y bar so now we will make a table of column similar to previous problem so first serial number serial number next basic shape basic shape basic shape area area in mm centimeter square previous problem is given in mm but in this problem the unit is given in centimeter therefore area in centimeter square next x x in centimeters y y in also centimeters compute ax 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 compute ay a y for the remarks. 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 So first thing, first thing. So here, how many basic shapes? First one is rectangle, 15 centimeter by 10 centimeter rectangle. Second one is triangle, triangle. The third one is semicircle. So we have to add rectangle plus triangle, and we have to remove the square. We have to remove the semicircle. So this is the problem. The first basic shape is rectangle. 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 So I am coming to remarks. So y axis here, x axis here, the rectangle. 15 centimeter and 10 centimeter. So if you identify the G, so G here to here, G. G is B by 2 comma d by 2 b by 2 comma d by 2 both are positive because first quadrant so now area a1 l into b l into b so 15 into 10 15 into 10 so what is a1 150 centimeter square now x1 x1 is b by 2 plus b by 2 because first quadrant so plus b by 2 matlab we are getting 10 by 2 so x1 is 5 5, five centimeters y1 y1 is b by 2 therefore y1 is 15 by 2 15 by 2 what is the value of 15 by 2 7.5 7.5 now compute a into x and compute a into y what is the value of ax 150 into 5 750. How much? 750. 750. What is the value of KY? 150 into 7.5. 1125. 1125. 25. 5. So the first one is over. Next, second one. What is the second basic shape? Triangle. 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 So now here X, here Y. This is the triangle. See, this is the triangle portion. 4 cm and this is 10, 10 cm, whatever. 10 cm. Now, this is G. So, G is, we are measuring with respect to y axis and we are measuring with respect to x axis. Therefore, it's a fourth quadrant. In fourth quadrant, x value is positive, y value is negative. Therefore, from here we are measuring, right? Here to here. This is right angle triangle. So, B by 3. From base. Base of the triangle we are measuring. From base of the triangle, the centroid is B by 3. From apex, 2 third of B. But we are measuring axis with respect to base. Therefore, B by 3. Similarly, 
y. This is x, right? Here to here. This is y. We are measuring with respect to x axis. That is minus of minus of d by 3. Because y is minus, y is negative. So minus d by 3. That this is also base. This is up x. So we are measuring with respect to this base. Here, this base. Here there are two apex. We are not measuring with respect to apex. We are measuring with respect to x axis is base. Y axis here also base. B by 3, y is minus d by 3. So area of triangle A2 is half into base into height. Therefore, half into base is 10 into height is 4. How much? A2? 20. 20. 20 centimeter square. Next x x2. X2 is b by 3. B by 3, positive. Therefore, x2 equals 10 by 3. Breadth is 10. What is the value of x2? 3.33. 33 centimeters. Then y2. Y2 is minus d by 3. Minus d by 3. Therefore, minus 4 by 3. How much? Minus 1.33 centimeter. Now multiply. A2, x2. 20 into 3.33. How much? 66.6. 66.6. 20 into minus 1.33. 20 into minus 1.33. 26.6 minus 26.6 minus 26.6 so over now I am coming to third the last basic shape that is semi circle now the axis here we are having y axis here we are having x axis but the semi circle is here like this right the semi circle like this this is the origin origin therefore uh, we are getting here to here distance this is 4r by 3 pi 4r by 3 pi now the g is g of semicircle is x what is the distance 10 right 10. positive first quadrant therefore x is 10 minus 4r by 3 pi this is x. What is y? It is symmetrical about uh, y axis. Therefore, here to here distance is y. This is radius. So, how much radius? 5, Five centimeter. Comma r radius. Y is this radius. Now, area A3 is pi r square by 2. So, pi into radius of semicircle given is 5 square by 2. How much? Pi into 25 by 2? That is A3. 39.26. 39.26. 26 cm square. Next, X3. X3 equal 10 minus 4R by 3 pi. Because this is reverse semicircle. We are measuring with respect to Y. Therefore, here to here distance is X. So, X3 is 10 minus 4 or by 3 pi 7.87 7 7.87 87 87 y3 is only radius r because the symmetry we are not getting y bar but we are measuring the origin with respect to origin that is radius therefore y3 is 5, five. both x and y are positive because in first quadrant. Therefore, what is A3, X3? Here also one more important thing we missed it. This is a not shaded area. There hence we have to deduct. Right? Therefore, minus A3. So this is minus minus 39.26. Because this is not shaded area. This is a cutout. So we have to remove that area. Clear? Therefore, AX, AY minus 39.26 multiplied by 7.87.
minus 39.26 multiplied by 7.87 minus 308.97 minus 308.97 97 next minus 39.26 multiplied by 5 minus 39.26 multiplied by 5 minus 196.3 minus 196.3 3 next compute sigma ax sigma a compute sigma ax compute sigma ay yes 150 plus 20 minus 39.26 150 plus 20 minus 39.26 130.74 130.74 four. next this one Sorry. 750 plus 66.6 minus 308.97 eight point nine seven. Five not seven point six three. Five not seven point six three. Six three. Next is one point two five minus twenty six point six minus one ninety six point three. One ninety six point three. Nine not two point one. Nine not two point one. One. Right? Now what is x bar? Sigma A x by A. Now x bar equals Sigma AX by Sigma A. What is the value of Sigma AX? 507.63 divided by Sigma A is 130.74. 130. What is the value? 3.88. 3.88 mm with respect to Y axis. Similarly, Y bar equals Sigma AY by Sigma A. Sigma AY is 902.1 divided by 130.74 what is the value 6.89 6.89 89 mm with respect to x axis if you want to represent so it's y it's the cut out this is the given this is x axis and y axis so x bar with respect to x axis this is g so x bar comma y bar. So this distance is x bar. How much? 3.88 3 centimeter. Centimeter, right? Yes. A centimeter. Sorry. This is centimeter. Don't make any mistake when you are representing the unit. Centimeter. 3.88 centimeter. And this one. This distance is 6.89 6 centimeter. centimeter. So brief representation of the centroid of given shaded area. It's also very very important. Please follow the rules. The rules is when you are deduction only area is negative. When you are considering x comma y, consider quadrantal sign. So in the given problem, the basic shapes are rectangle, triangle, semicircle. We have to add rectangle and triangle. We have to cut out the cut out the deduct semicircle. Follow as usual. Compute sigma a, sigma a y, sigma a. Using the relevant equation, is x bar is sigma a x by sigma a. Y bar is sigma a y by sigma a. Compute the centroid. X bar is always measuring with respect to y axis. Y bar is always measuring with respect to x axis. So this is regarding this particular type of problem. Thank you.